Hello there guys, welcome back to my video blog, The Hoxton Trend. Today I'm going to be showing you this really nice jacket, it's called a Montclair Rochefort. It's actually one of my favourite jackets this one. I just love the blend of the nylon material along with the wool. I love that combination of the material and I just think the jacket is extremely cool. Um, yeah, and I've got one in, it's an excellent example of one. Um, so yeah, let me stop frapping around, let me show you the jacket, cool. So yeah, it's got a nylon finish to the outside as you can see, but what's really cool is it's got the wool finish that goes on down the middle, as you can see there, along where the zip line is, and it goes all the way around the collar as well, which is very nice. And of course, it goes down the side of the arm and on the shoulder. I just, I just really like that, I think it just gives the jacket a really nice detail and a really nice finish and the quality of the wool is really nice as well really nice brush feel um, I've seen a lot of uh, jacket um, manufacturers I've seen a lot of high street men's manufacturers trying to pull off this nylon with the wool look and when I see the jackets they just don't look right to me some of them can end up looking quite cheap but what I like about this one is it Montclair have managed to pull it off really well with the detailing which is cool so yeah, you can see the nylon finish on the back there, and again, the wool finish detailing that goes right along across the shoulders there, and along the back of the arms as well. Um, so yeah, if we open this up, <laughs> we can have a look inside, and see what we've got. So, it's got a cartoon logo there, which, um, which again, guys, this should be very slightly faded. What I mean by faded is, it's not overly bright. The colours are not too strong. It just looks, just doesn't look as striking, and that's exactly how it's meant to be. And the reason why I'm emphasising this even more is because whilst looking through eBay, I've seen so many jackets, some of them looking very genuine, and when you come across this cartoon logo, it's very bright. It's a very bright print. That's a sign of a more cheaper style of printing, because the counterfeiters they don't want to spend big money on getting the printing right. They just want to get it looking right very quickly. They're not going to spend the money on getting it 100% right. So guys, if you're coming across these Montclair jackets on wherever you're seeing them, Gumtree, eBay, or you're just buying it off someone, wherever, and you're not sure, ensure that this uh, cartoon logo is slightly faded and not overly uh, rich in colour. Okay? If you see that the colours are so bright, guys, look out, could be a fake. Okay? Um, this jacket is a 2014 jacket, it's got the QR code there, okay, and as you can see, Montclair Rochefort, okay, there we go, dry clean only, okay, don't put this in the washing machine, that's obviously because of the wool, wool finish. Um, what I like about this jacket is this really big thick collar that you can see there, nice big thick wool collar that goes all the way around and when you wear the jacket you can kind of have it so it wraps around your neck like that which I, 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 just, I just love that. Um, the, the hood is removable so the hood can come off, it does have a button feature there so, the, so it can come off. Uh, and if you look at the button there you can see the Montclair engraved on the side. But yeah, you can take this off if you want. It's got a feature there so you can take it off. So if you do, jacket becomes hoodless, which is cool. This jacket is down insulated. It's quite thick, very warm. No need to wear this in the spring, summer. Far too warm, strictly for the winter. Okay. Um, <clears throat> if we have a look at the zips, you can see by the zips are by Lampo, as you can see right there. Okay. Uh, I've got this, this is a size 2. I, I won't be selling this, I'll be keeping this. Um, the main reason why I managed to source this jacket for myself is be simply because I had a jacket before which was called a, a Montclair Le Blonde, Le Blonde I believe it's called, which was very similar to this and I, it was really really nice jacket, had the polyamide finish, had the cotton finish to the front you can't get this jacket anymore and I ended up selling this jacket when I sourced it and when I did sell it I totally regretted it I said damn I should never have sold this jacket I should have kept it as part of my own collection so that jacket was you know done and dusted long gone then when I came a couple of months later I came across the Rochefort and I said there's no way I can let this jacket go 
uh, and there's no way I'm going to sell it. It's just, it's, this is one of my favourite pieces. So yeah, Montclair Rochefort guys. Um, but not easy to get. Quite a rare jacket. Just showing you this detail in here on the bottom of the zip to the top. That's in wool, wool finish as well. Um, yeah, that's it. Buttons are all engraved with the Montclair.